I used to come up here as an amateur. So I had a small telescope that I made, and I kind of played hide and seek with the, the sheriff that used to work up here. I wasn't really part of the observatory, so I kind of learned how to just hide from him. And I had a secret spot where I kept my telescope that he never found. I just knew that somehow this place was going to be a part of my life. Plus the world's first mountaintop observatory in 1888, roughly, was when it was finished. Well, this is back before they could, you know, weld big pieces of things together. So all this stuff is put together with rivets, as you can see, the dome and telescope. It's all riveted pieces brought up here on mule train. The level of craftsmanship here is, is like something we don't see anymore. It's really quite impressive. When it's dark, these are lit up, and we can watch these circles turn and, and push it until we get it right to the place we want. Saturn through this telescope is pretty amazing to the eye. When you look at Saturn through the eye and you see that ball out there with a ring around it just floating out in space, it becomes very real. Looking at that without any CCD camera or anything between you and the image, just you and your retina, that's, a, that's quite an experience. We're trying to keep this as a real heritage piece. It's a, quite an amazing jewel. So this is all part of UC investing in the science and astronomy. And this was at the cutting edge back in 1888. And then as the decades go by, we develop new technologies so we can stay right at that cutting edge. My name is Steve Vogt. I'm a professor of astronomy and astrophysics at the University of California at Santa Cruz. Only job I ever had, but why would you want to work anywhere else? <laughs>